you know, things happen in a goalkeeping point of view so quickly, when you do react and you produce a moment of magic, it's very satisfying and uh, the, the sort of euphoria that you get from that, you know, you can't, you can't, um, you can't buy it. Balbiola had, oh, Jamie Young again, Ninkovic for a teammate and Jamie Young keeps it out. Why do I want to become a keeper? I, I guess it's because I played a lot of different hand-eye coordination sports, you know, tennis, cricket, um, golf, those kind of sports, even rugby, um, you know, so that kind of gravitated towards using my hands a lot. Um, and I suppose the lack of running, um, because I'm a little bit bulkier, I think suited me, so that's probably why. Jamie Young won't be beaten. The technical and physical attributes needed to save shots have to be very efficient. Um, so the hard working element as a goalkeeper is crucial. But what I think is even more crucial is this ability to overcome setbacks and failure, and that's resilience. And I think that feeds into being more determined um, and, and that feeds back into being hard working again. So it's hard working and resilience that I think are really important as a goalkeeper. If you're hard working, you're rigorously testing yourself in training. So when you do come to the competition, that stress testing allows you to perform. You know you've done the work, you know your attributes and your weaknesses, but you also know under pressure you can perform. Young players, they have to keep getting on the bike every day. It's a daily occurrence of showing up through rituals and habits.